Okay, so we, we don't have only external tasks, we have some inter internal tasks too. So we have members all over the world, a fairly big number of members, but you know it's a fairly old um, association now. We are more than 50 years old and the process to, um, on the one hand, to find out what our members are doing in reality do they really comply with the aims of the convention and on the other hand we want to open our doors for new members for instance self-advocates movements they have their own panels etc etc or young parents who want to act in line with the convention all that mm -hmm. is to include everybody who is really active in that field in our organization we need the support of all councillors from all regions because they are the ones who can find people and associations and groups who, who really should, um, well, should have the right to be included in our movement. And so we have um, discussed for three days um, how we can find new members and for that you need criteria and it's not an easy task because um, we have traditional members and we have our constitution and the constitution tells us at the moment one member per country and then it's difficult to change the position we have to accept that perhaps in future we have more members per country and do they have the same rights do they have the right to vote all of them or do only some of them have this right this needs to be discussed and we want to well to deliver concrete proposals um, I think in 2016 in October 2016 on the occasion of our next General Assembly